here's something brand new on up late. Look at this. A break in is costing an Atlanta convenience store owner big time. The security camera captured it all as burglars got out with $30,000 worth of merchandise. The owner tells us this is the third time burglars have hit his store in the last three years. He tells John Sherrick it may have all destroyed his livelihood. How did they get inside the store? Why didn't the alarm go off? Over the weekend, a team of burglars somehow got inside Lamine Chom's convenience store, then broke through two locked interior doors and ransacked the area behind the counter, taking all the merchandise they could, plus rolls of lottery scratch-off tickets. They broke in after Chom closed late Saturday night. The next morning, when he got ready to reopen. I said, oh my God, that is a break-in. Chom counts his losses at more than 30000 Everything in behind the counter. Lamine Chom has owned Lolo Mini Mart on James Jackson Parkway in Northwest Atlanta for seven years. A family run business, trying, he says, to serve this community, a troubled area. He's tried to secure his store inside a fortress, but burglars keep finding a way to get inside. And this was the third time, he tells me, in the past three years. 80% of my customers are old, old folks. They love here and I love my customers. He can't buy insurance anymore. He says the policies now cost more than he can afford because of the crime. And he says he can't absorb this loss of more than 30 grand. I may have to sell the business or walk away from it because it's just frustrating. All the hard work, you know, just disappears in a few minutes. Chom is counting on Atlanta police to help him find out who the burglars are. He's offering a reward of $1,000. And beyond that, he says he wishes he could figure out a way to stay in business here for the people of this community he says he loves.